guys you are welcome to my channel this is the one and the only chick on the space how are you guys doing trusting you and your family are doing great and we are so wonderful today so you are welcome if you are new in our channel you are highly welcome i thank you so much for stopping by kindly support our channel by subscribing share our videos and give us a thumbs up please my old people in the house thank you so much for supporting me in my channel here god bless you all so in today's video i will show you how i do my cocoa yam soup you can see here this is the cocoa yam powder so this is a powdered one i just bought it like this in african shop and uh, we're going to make use of it today this is my stock dish guys you can see it here and this is uh, spinach Dew spinach and this is the um shrimps and the autoballs everything is here this is mixed um seafood guys this is my crayfish my dry fish the fish i made here in our channel if you don't know how we made this fish check our channel there you will see how we prepare it and this is my fresh fish my goat meat guys so I will be introducing other ingredients as we go on. So if you want to see how we prepare this, amazing soup. Just continue watching and God bless you. Thank you. So I will go on by boiling the meat. some spices and add some water in it. I will be cooking it in very hot. So as it's cooking now, I will go on and make the fufu I will use to make this look at the fufu here I I will just make uh, some some fufu this is how it looks like when you open it this is how it looks like mama's choice so I do prepare mine as if it is a fufu before I can add it in my soup so watch how I will prepare it as the water is like this i don't i will not allow it to be too hot before i can begin to add this is how i make the fufu i used to do my cook my uh, cocoa yam soup guys so if you are adding depending on the quantity of the soup you want to do Melting it when the water is not too hot would make we make the cocoa yam fufu not to have long so just melt it as you are melting it the water is getting hot and then it will begin to turn okay because i'm not doing a, a much soup i'm not doing the quantity of the soup I am preparing is not much. I will not make the soup to be. I will not make the cocoa yam uh, fufu to be much. You can see what I'm doing here. This is. I think this is done. It's okay for me. I will not do much. So this is how we will be turning it like fufu until it is strong. So I will show you the outcome of it. Okay, I will not show you everything so that the, our video will not be too long. So you can now see how the fufu is, the kokoyam fufu. You can see how it is. Now it is ready to add in the soup. Okay, why are we making this kokoyam soup? We are gonna use it to thicken the soup. Okay, guys. So I explained this very well for for those who don't know this method. Some people do 
uh, add the, the powder in the soup you can also do that but i prefer the one of turning it like this before i can make use of it you can see how it is so this is what we are gonna use to for this goyam soup continue watching now i will go on and uh, avoid my my fish my mackerel fish as usual guys i add salt and i add my cheese and i add some forget to add our onion very okay so I will go on now to open the spinner so I'll cut the spinner and I'll put it here in the frozen one So what I do now is I go on and begin to cut it into pieces because this is uh, I will cut it into pieces. How it looks like after cutting it into pieces, guys. So, so our fish are done. We work on and bring it out, guys. So this is the final look of the fish. So we go on and begin to prepare our soup. I will add the fish, guys, and the cocoa. I use salt. I put small salt on it. This will make this cocoa to the fish so far. You see how it is now? I turn it. This will make it to melt so far. Then I'll begin to cut and put inside. That's how I do it. So I never eat so mess so fast, guys. This starts as the thickener, guys. So because I'm the soup I am preparing is not gonna be much. That's why I mess a little. So I will now cover to cook for at least 10 minutes or 20 minutes. Just allow it to um to melt, okay? So now we will go on and add our oil, guys. As it's boiling, we add our oil. And give it a smoke here. You can see this is cooking guys. It's cooking guys. So we now go on and add our our coffee. a little bit of water we add water we start cooking we 
All the cocoa yam have narrowed now. We go on and add all the ingredients we are using in this soup, guys. Okay. Now I will go on and add this our goat meat, guys. Already cooked with um, pressure pot. Yeah, I do like to use pressure pot to cook uh, my meat. Just don't work, doesn't work any time. 10 minutes, 15 minutes is already done. So, I will also add some of the meat stuff here. Not much. See, it's moving, guys. Wow. I will add my cube. And remember, we are using this, guys. Okay? We go on now and add it to cook very well, guys. Okay, guys. Look at how it is. I have to wash it. Clean it. Then I will add. Now, I will use the water and salt to wash the seafood before i can add it into the pot just watch what i will see i added a small salt if there is any germs or sand in it this the salt will make it to go out then i will save it and add it into the pot i'm adding hot water in it guys just continue watching Wow, this soup is Owanine, uh, guys. It is Owanine, oh. You see? So, our vegetable, that is peanuts, will be the last thing we will add, guys. And the, our cocoyam soup will be ready in a moment from now, guys. So if you like, you can add some water, but I don't like, I don't want to add another water because a little bit of water inside, if we add water now, it will be too much. So we go on and add our peanut guys. We go on and add our spinach. And we also add our fish. We add our spinach and we'll add our fish. And give it a small stir. And our soup is ready now. Whatever I cook, I cook it. And my kids are eating. You know, children don't like too much salt. And I just add a little bit of salt. I'm um, sorry, pepper. So guys, the food is ready. You can see the soup is delicious and tantalizing. So thank you so much for watching. Kindly give me a thumbs up and share this video. Bye for now. I love you all, but the Lord God loves you most. Bye. Wow, this is amazing. A good see.